Are we recording something after this? Yes. Oh no. <laughs> what? You shall see. Oh, is it the monkey game? <laughs> monkey! Monkey time. Monkey! Wait. Alright, hold on. <laughs> monkey! Monkey. <laughs> monkey. <laughs> I love the music for the death, the death thing. I don't know why. <laughs> it's just super like, uh, you. It's you like you almost died. There. Huzzah! It's okay. You get another turn. You get another turn, you stupid bitch. <laughs> you can die once more. <laughs> death is truly meaningless when you have seventy-seven credits, you whore. <clears throat> you all right? <laughs> So I'm just gonna finish my talking of Genshin. Yep. So people don't only call this game Breath of the Wild clone, uh, purely based off of the aesthetic, what which does slander? look like Breath of the Wild. What other slander? God fucking son of a bitch, damn it! What other slander? It has is a fucking game? stamina system, and you could climb basically anything with your stamina, and you also have a glider that you can use to get to places. Huh? Isn't the, flying system, isn't the flying system different, though? How? No, I'm asking. Mm, um, no. It's basically the same. It uses your stamina when you're gliding. And then when you run out, you can't glide no more and you fall. You know, I wouldn't take the Angry Video Game Nerd as a way to learn how to play video games, but, uh... When he said don't ever get the fire in this game, that's some of the most solid advice you could follow. Don't get the fire in this game. Remember when Angry Video Gamer and Nostalgia Critic switched? And then Angry Video Gamer did a movie? And then Nostalgia Critic did a game? Wasn't it that they both did- they did like a- they did- Nostalgia Critic reviewed a game that was made by LJN. Like a movie licensed game made by LJN. And then, uh, the nerd played the- the, the nerd, like, reviewed the movie? I'm pretty sure that was the collab. It was like something Bebe or something. Oh, was it Bebe's kids? Yeah. Come over here, um, you fuck. <laughs> and what was, 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 what's the best part is that, uh, um, Nos Nostalgia Critic was not good at reviewing games. Well, uh, James was just so, like, fucking good at, you know, he was doing a better job. He was doing a better job at Nostalgia Critic's own, like, job oh, than Nostalgia on, Critic was doing at on. reviewing a game. It was showing that Nostalgia Critic sucks. <clears throat> are there people that are still, like, actual fans of Nostalgia Critic? Uh, this happened last time? My controller's not working again. I'm, a uh, okay. See, this is why you don't use the Steam controller. What? Huh? <laughs> Bro? Who's using a Steam controller, bro? <laughs> so what controller are you using for this? Uh... The Nintendo Wii Classic controller. Mmm. Great. Which is actually a really good controller, and I... <laughs> I'm kind of... and oh, I'm not set, but... It would've been cool if more Wii games allowed you to use the Classic controller instead of a Wii Remote. Mm hmm Uh... I know... What it is? It, um, I think Xenoblades uh, lets you use the classic controller, which is actually pretty cool considering how like the control works for that game. Much better. <coughs> so back to Genbin. Um, yeah, it's 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 more it, okay. It does have his Breath of the Wild, you know, influences. But it's still a good game on its own, right? Sure. It's still pretty fun to go around slaying some, uh... Um... Slime monsters. Will I say it's better than Breath of the Wild? No. I don't... I don't know. Luis has no opinion yet. Uh... He'll see. I, well, I doubt it'll... Pr I doubt it's gonna be better than Breath of the Wild, regardless. 
I try to move. Okay, this is a fucking issue I have. Every single time you get close to a ladder and you try to like press to move left or right, you get like stuck on the ladder. But I didn't go. I didn't press up to use the ladder. It just forces me to be stuck on there for no goddamn reason. At least you're using the ladder this time. Instead of a. Uh... <laughs> Donkey Kong. Our first time playing Donkey Kong on the show and you fuck it up, Luis. I wonder when we're gonna play Donkey Kong. We already did. Yo! We did! Hmm? That was a full game right there and you fucked it up! Have you- Oh, son of a whore. You Why are you played? having trouble understanding what I'm saying? Yeah, I already have. You're. Uh, fu uh, I'm dying. Y have you ever played Donkey Kong on an arcade ma arcade machine? Me and my homies hate Donkey Kong. Do you not like it? It's fine. I love Donkey Kong. I prefer Donkey Kong Jr. though. What is the? Oh, it's a fire. I prefer Jr. just because the platforming is. Better. I mean, well, you know, this is a game from night. That old Donkey Kong is a game from 1981. Like, it's not like platforming was figured out then. They were. <laughs> Didn't they have Pitfall back then? Pitfall was 1982. Shit, that's crazy. That's wild. I really like old platformers just because um. It's interesting to see, like, the ideas and stuff, how they got brought about. Fuck. Whoa! Um. <laughs> Pain Arc is back. Uh. I don't have enough for an eye, so we're just Pan. No pain, Pan. <laughs> um. Son of a bitch. I don't fuck with- I don't fuck with any type of gambling in games. Conversely, I like gambling in video games. My favorite thing. Truly, the existential crux from which this world should be fucking- oh, fuck. Alright. As I was saying, I do not fuck with any you gambling do not in my fuck? games. Both of what I just- both- yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That, yeah. Right. Um, me and my homies hate gambling in games. Do you, Luis? I literally just bit while you were away, I was like, oh, gambling in games is my favorite thing ever. No, I don't. <laughs> I, I hate gambling in video games. <laughs> yeah, no, 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 yeah, I do. I do. I love gambling. Um, I don't care if you're a free fucking game either. I don't care if that's your only way of making money. Fortnite could get this fucking far, and they even- they don't, There's no gambling in Fortnite! Well, you're gambling- you're fucking, gambling with your credibility as a good human being by playing with- playing Fortnite. You're gambling with your mental stability when playing Fortnite. You're gambling with your virginity. Or you're not, because you're not gonna lose it. Oh, okay. Devil dead. Devil okay, dead. you're gambling with your virginity? If you had the greatest luck of all time. Remain pure, boys. Virginity is cool. Luis, you, you, you don't even fucking have yours. Get the fuck out of here. I don't. <laughs> I lost. It's in the wall. I'm so- The Japs took it from me! <laughs> I'll never forgive the Japanese! <laughs> uh, I'm just so- I'm so frustrated right now. Just, I mean, I get- okay, you know what? Fuck it. I'll- I'll let myself get injured. No, come on. Oh, are you can fucking I? kidding me? The one time I can get on the fucking thing, the fucking platform is a fucking there! Apparently Genshin, um, has... <sighs> a battle pass? And apparently it's bad. Like, really bad. Battle passes are fucking good. Those are good. I apologize for my previous statements. If you want your multiplayer game to make money, go with battle passes. Right? Don't go with gambling. 
What about charging? Me and my homies hate gambling. What about charging for virginity checks? <laughs> how do you how do you check that? Remember, I'm suddenly how remember do you check we were, that? I remember when we were talking about in Resident Evil about Ti wanting to get his daughter a hymen check, and then like uh, we were like hymen check, and then I screamed I like a little that girl. Abe was in a f I forgot Abe was in that episode. Oh yeah, like we had Abe for that session of Resident Evil because like uh, he, he was just Dragon with Ball us. Was right yeah, because we were recording Dragon Ball Z, but he was just with us. What the fuck were we thinking? God. Oh, Nothing okay, now I sort of it. understand why you get locked. Whenever you crouch, you get locked for an extra second. Sick. Please, 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 just um, come over here. Okay, good. Hey, on for now you cool. want. The battle pass system is fucking great. It's not predatory. <laughs> You pay for one battle pass, and if you save up all the VC, not not the VC, V bucks, you could pay for the next battle pass, and you could just keep going with no care in the world. Um, so Genshin's what I've been playing recently, like the newest thing I've started. Hmm. But I've also gone and back into playing single player games. Uh. And now this is my time to talk about what I've been doing, whereas Luce in Costume Quest was talking about. His shit. Oh yeah, I just- While Luce was on his anime journey. To, to quickly I finish that, uh, video I, I finished Ocarina of Time. Uh, I was close to finishing it when we were recording Cosmic Quest, but I- I finished the game! Finished the game! Yeah. Uh, I finished the game and it sucks. I don't uh, know how you oot fuckers play that shit. Actually, no, my opinion- my I'll opinion go back on, to my real game, my Zelda 2. My opinion it changed, which is surprising. My opinion on stuff don't change usually, so... Yeah, because, um, I mean, Luis is always wrong. I'm literally always right. Since when? Not about anime or video games, but <laughs> in real life, I'm, like, always right. So what's your opinion on the... On... What you... Homosexuality uh, in video games? Yeah, sure. <laughs> <laughs> what oh. were you gonna ask? <laughs> What's your opinion on homosexuality in video games? <laughs> Who the hell raped your sister? <laughs> Bro? <laughs> Bro? I love that interview. <laughs> Please put up the video so we're not taken out of context. <laughs> and I talk about it more Why on the, the album. I talk about it more that? on the album. So who the hell raped your sister? <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck's his problem? <laughs> oh, fucking Charlemagne. Um. This music's good. <laughs> Wait, what, what did you say? <laughs> um... You were talking about Ocarina of Time. Are you gonna finish talking about Ocarina of Time, or no? It's a great game. It's honestly one of the best games I've ever played. And I feel as I've grown older, I've allowed uh, outside opinions to let me become more jaded and cynical about it, but once again experiencing it now with an adult mindset, I've truly can appreciate that game for what how truly great it is although i still don't i still don't think it's one of the i still don't think it's the best zelda game but it's definitely up there oh so much pain this <laughs> car uh, and bull torture i love it all <sighs> um what was your opinion about ocarina of time before uh you think it was bad it was okay and now you like it. Uh, yeah. Sick. When was the last time you had played that game? <sighs> what are we- what am I? Pooh. <sighs> Pooh. Pooh! Pooh! <laughs> uh, I played that- I played that game to completion when it first came out in 2011, and then... <laughs> yeah, that's when it first came out. No, the 3DS version. Um... <laughs> yeah, that was, that's when the 64 game came out, huh? Uh, and then, uh... 
I replayed it again around 2015, and I was like, this shit's ass. But I think that was like, or whenever like Sequelitis came out. <laughs> oh no. I think my- You I trusted think, that man. I think my opinion of Ocarina of Time was influenced a lot <laughs> of what Aaron said about it, and like- And then you learned that man cannot be trusted. I learned that man cannot be trusted, but also, like, I, I, I did rewatch the sequelitis, sequelitis video, uh, last night. I like night, those videos. And, I like um, watching those. You know, to be honest, his complaints aren't good, but they're not invalid. Yeah. Um... How'd you feel about the Mega Man sequelitises? Did you agree with them on those? Uh, I want to throw somebody off a cliff. Hey, you signed up for this. Just because- So? Just because you do something doesn't mean you can't get mad about it. Okay, I did kill those kids. But why are you gonna put me in jail? I don't want to go to jail. That's a terrible- I didn't know I was gonna That's go to jail. That's a terrible comparison, you fuck. But I didn't know killing kids would put me in jail. Jail sucks. Guess I shouldn't have killed those kids. That's an awful comparison. Hmm, yes, I would pick hard game to play. Oh, wait. This game's hard. I'm mad now. I mean, people willingly play Uno despite that game being like the stupidest fucking shit. Uno's fucking sick, take that back. Uno is fucking sick, but game design-wise, it's horrible. No, it's amazing. Fuck Uno. poker, me and my homies play Uno. I love poker. Uno, Uno is the same, gives me the same feeling that Mario Party does. I know Luis has probably picked up the whole deck looking for a blue and he just couldn't find it. Coming down to Georgia, coming down to play the ghosts and goblins, coming down to play the ghosts and goblins game. We coming out here to get on this shield, and we gonna run, we gonna pump, and we gonna go and gonna ghost and goblins. <laughs> ghosts and goblins, y'all. It's a ghost, you got a man running. His name is Arthur. He's got no bloomers, he's just got pantaloons. He riding, he's riding. There's a there's a bat, and there's a red devil about to kill me! The fucking like fan the is on. Uh, Did you like the bass line? Uh, that I put in? Uh, uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, I th um, mm -hmm. Did you like the bass line I added? I think you really added something to the music. I, th I think I can kill a, a small child. Huh? I think I can Louis, murder- Luis, only an allergy! Stop! I, I think I can murder a small child. Oh... Larry, ho, ho. please don't- Larry, please don't take away the baseline I put in. Oh. I put work into that. I Larry, think... please! This fucking hot dog, but the fucking rolled up weenie sausage motherfucker hitting me! I was gonna talk about the games I've played. Uh... I don't know what happened to the discussion. What happened to the original plot of the movie? <laughs> what happened to the original plot? Every shot is so dense. <laughs> <laughs> so, games I've been playing. Uh, a little bit of Genshin. Uh, 2K, because my friends play, and I'm forced to play that game, because my friends play. Mm. No, I didn't buy the game. I am game sharing. But I did have to put money in to make my character be actually, like, be able to play basketball. Mm. My fault. Mm. Look. Mm. Not only that... Um, I've been playing Halo 3 on the Master Chief Collection. I Plus, a little bit of reach. Inhuman levels of violence. You crave cock. I do not. Straight cock. I am a straight heterosexual male. And I do not desire penis um, of any kind. I don't know. I don't know if that's correct, Luis. Oh! I think you might got some, uh,. Homosexuality within you. Uh, 
bring up the records. Um, you know what the definition of insanity is, Harry? Can you not quote the video game? D video game. Isn't that like the improper definition too? Like that's just the shit that they made up for that. Like the actual definition. Oh yeah, they just different. just they just said shit. <laughs> they just be doing. It. They're like, we're gonna say something and act smart, so people think we deep, but really we just saying shit <sighs> to say shit. Do you know what the definition of insanity is? Is doing the same thing over and over. Expecting different results. Mm, mm. No one fucking isn't. That isn't the definition. Y'all made that shit up. Um. Oh boy, oh boy. Do I sure love playing Gaston and Goblins on the fucking arcade machine. Released for the CPS1 Capcom arcade machine, I think. Uh, Since Luis has taken up my time, I will go further beyond than 20 minutes. Uh. Um. <coughs> Um, I've also been playing uh, oh, no. Halo 3, which is really fucking good. I love that game. Yes. Um, <laughs> they've recently updated the PC version to have ODST in it, and then they also up the, up, updated both versions so that ODST weapons are in Halo 3. Mm. And they work well in the game, although the pistol mm -hmm. is kind of OD. Which is why they have it in its own separate playlist. And it's fun. They've also added a battle pass for Halo 3 stuff. Such as colored visors. You can make your visor green or blue or red. Or that's cool. There's no armor sadly. But that's fine. They also added weapon skins for the AR, the pistol, and the battle rifle. That shit's sick. Come further this way, you fuck. Oh, now I- What the fuck? What the fuck can I actually fucking do about that fucking shit? They also added- I'm done. I'm a done. better hit I'm registration. I'm fucking- I'm done. They added a better hit registration to Halo 3. And that shit works flawlessly now. Love those games. I also went on to play two single player games that- Weren't on the top of my list of games to play, but it just kind of became that. Uh, two games that had very similar fates of being put out at the wrong time and being not overshadowed, but being put out into an oversaturated market. Both of these games are shooters. <laughs> you could put on Zelda or something. Luis? Luis! Can we please finish this episode? But I want to finish what I'm talking about. You just finish what you're talking about. Can you respond to me? Like we're, we're talking regularly? Um. I don't believe I have the mental capacity to do so. Yes, you do. Um. <sighs> so yeah. Uh, one of these games that I played is Bulletstorm. <sighs> which was... Let me see. Made by uh, who the fuck made this game? Who the fuck? Who the fuck wrote this? All right. Uh. Made by Epic Games and developer People Can Fly, who have made uh, gears. They ported Gears of War one. Um, they co-developed Gears of War two. They did all that shit. Bulletstorm is a fucking fir is a first person shooter that has you playing as I believe it's who voice act him. Where's the voice actor? Is it Steve Bloom? Yep, yeah, Steve Bloom. You're playing as him. And man, I should have saved this for another thing. I played Bulletstorm and Vanquish. I'll talk about that on an episode of something else. Bye.